Welcome back to the Arizona Daily Mix. I am very excited about this interview because I have had the pleasure of working with the man who ASU has named uh, their film and arts department after at City Portier. And Stephen, he is here with us from Arizona State University. How are you doing, sir? I am great. It's good to see you. Good to be uh, to be here today. Yeah, let's talk about this. This is such an amazing honor uh, for not just ASU, but Mr. Portier, too, to uh, have this collaboration and to have a, 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 a amazing, um, how can I say, department named after him. Yeah. Um, look, you know, we're, uh, we built this new American film school. It's part of the Herberger Institute for, for Design and the Arts at Arizona State University. We, we uh, launched this film school this past year. And uh, we knew that, um, you know, we wanted to build something completely different than all the other elite film schools in the nation. Um, and so when we thought about inclusive filmmaking and we thought about ethical filmmaking and sort of, you know, can we build something that the world needs right now. Um, uh, and, and so Sidney Poitier is the embodiment of all of those values of, uh, uh, I mean, you can't imagine anybody whose name um, is as uh, readily known and beloved and admired, respected, uh, his dignity, his persistence, his excellence, like every adjective, there's not a single adjective on the positive side of the ledger that you can come up with that, that doesn't represent who this man is. Yeah, and, and like I said, I've had the pleasure of working with him. And I think the biggest pleasure is that we're bringing film to Arizona. We, You guys have listened to your students, which is so important because I have staff we have here who have taken small film classes here and there, and they were very excited that ASU has decided to start this program. And, and it's going to expand our film business here, I think. Absolutely. Um, so we've already got 700 students in the film school. It's been growing as a department over the years, and now it's its own school. And it will have a footprint in Los Angeles at the Herald Examiner building, um, downtown Mesa with partnership with the city. They've invested in constructing a 117,000 square foot facility, state of the art, the best, uh, best sound stages, the best editing rooms, the best production spaces. Um, and so uh, yeah, it's not just this one building. I think your point about Arizona being a center for film and media production, why shouldn't we be? I mean, we're a 45 minute flight from the heart of the heart of the entertainment capital of the world. Um, and so this is an easy place to, uh, to make film and television and media. And now we've got the, we've got the talent, we're growing the talent, we've got the facilities, we've got the name and reputation. So if Arizona in the next decade doesn't assume its rightful place as a destination for producing film, television, media, uh, we will have dropped the ball. Well, Stephen, I'll tell you, I'm so excited for this uh, film school. I think it's amazing. And I know uh, those who are looking to get into film school at ASU, all they got to do is go to the website uh, for ASU school and, and they're in. Stephen, they're in. you and I will definitely off camera sit and talk about my experience with uh, Mr. Portier and, and just how Can't incredible wait. it was. So, hey, thanks for joining us. Sure, thank you.